haven't streamed in forever, so... But, uh, hi! How you doing? Doing alright. I'm doing alright. I was just needing a stream, uh, break from stream. Um, but, you know, I started a new job. Uh, started working at one of the places I used to work at. Been going well, but, uh, I guess was getting used to working a uh, couple shifts a week and stuff, but, um, at least now I have a proper work schedule. Um, which is good. There's a, there, there's a bit of shifting, but, uh, the microphone and stuff, but, yeah! Um, Right now, I'm not gonna really have a streaming schedule at the moment. Since I'm, you know, mostly doing it for fun. Uh, so. But obviously, when I get, when I finally get to a point where I can start doing this uh, full time, I will actually start having a proper schedule. But for now, I'm just, you know, enjoying myself. Because that's what matters. Um... So, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I miss... I... I miss doing streams and stuff as well. So. Because it's fun. It just takes a lot of energy. But, uh... Yeah. Okay. Yes, she does. Because I'm like... You know? Because I mean... Yeah, of course she will. Like... The thing with Wister is that her design should have already been done, but I can't... Make up my mind as to what I want her to wear because, like, I still want her to, you know, look like a princess, even when she's adventuring. But, you know, still look cool and stuff, and still look practical, so that's kind of. Um. Uh, so. Yeah, it's kind of frustrating, I'm alive. Okay. Uh yeah, okay. I'm gonna redo this. I forgot he moved my tool panel. Uh <laughs> okay. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? Uh Yeah, I will. I will. Fine enough. Hopefully. Okay. Also, I have to find a proper balance for like my 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 stuff. <laughs> Down alert, so you stay there. There you go. Yeah, I'll find a I'll find a proper balance soon. I also have to figure out like um I don't know. I'll have to figure out how to get um
Like, I'm trying to figure out, like, uh, I have to figure out a uh, proper aspect ratio so I can show, like, the whole screen. Like, that will, like, display. Uh oh. You know, it's a balance I have to work on getting. But, that's alright. Ugh. something like stuck in my mouth didn't feel good at all okay. actually I think I might have her have her hair down because you know she's not gonna have to braid for long anyways oh. like most of the time I draw her with like her hair down anyway, so... I don't know. I turned on my tablet again by accident. God dang it. Oh shit. Hang on. Uh... Totally forgot to post a link to my stream. Ugh. Which? Ugh. Link. How do I expect people to find my stream if I don't, you know, post it? You know? Okay, there you go, there you go, there you go. Okay, okay. Much better now. Okay. Uh... Okay, alright, okay. Uh... Okay, Pinterest might be the reference. I love designing outfits, and I mean, I can just, I could just go back to the outfit I already designed for her, just modify it. Uh, because I really liked what I had. Um, it's just so frustrating. Um, but, uh. You know, but it is. Um, I'm just gonna. Just because I need to see what I'm doing. Like, what I'm doing. I liked. Like. 
I don't know. I like that part. Um, I think I'm just gonna get rid of. I mean, it's pretty, but I'm just gonna have her like. I have her like have her hair down or give her a different hairstyle. Um, so. so frustrating um i'm trying to come up with designs and stuff and it's just like Ugh. uh but i do um i do have that it, uh... okay so i have wisteria i have Aerith, i have estia adorable little uh... am I going to make her into a fairy I mean I can make her into a fairy well um actually I'm really liking the how I did probably make them a bit more detail yeah she's a small four feet nine bean good bean Sweet bean, yes. And I forgot to add in the flowers that she has on her hat, but that's fine. That's great. Ribbons is fine. Uh, but... Um... I mean... You'd think that, oh, well, you know, since... She's gonna be traveling with the other people, with the other characters, because she's one of the main characters. Uh, you know... You'd think I'd give her a more practical outfit, but... Uh... She's a mage. So, you bet she has some spells to keep, uh... To keep her close pristine, you know? And she's, like, doing long-distance attacks, so... So she'll be fine. Exactly. I mean, she does long distance attacks, so. Meanwhile, Wistria and Aerith on the other end are like. They're more close range. But. Exactly. But. Estia's. Uh, but, well, actually. Astia is a longer range attacks mostly. Uh, sometimes she will attack like physically and stuff, but. Yeah, exactly! Uh. Um. I mean, she's not a witch. So, normally witches have the long pointy hats, but. I still think they're long pointy hats. Especially if they're like all. Really and cute decorated and stuff, so. That, uh, I mean, it doesn't have to be pointy either, it could just be, you know, those fancy, like, hats and stuff, but. Ah, I mean, she's a mage, but still. But. Uh. And I mean, hey, she's gotta protect her eyes and her face from the sun, so, you know. I get sunburns. Ah, oh, could be, could be, could be. But the important thing is that uh, Estia looks absolutely, absolutely adorable. That's, you know. 
and fashionable. Oh, uh, but okay. So yeah, so Vistoria and Aerith are both mostly close range. Have swords and stuff. So yes, protect us. Yeah, I mean. She's perfectly capable of protecting herself, but, like... Uh, she doesn't mind if a big, strong woman attacks her. Okay. Like, oh. Alright. <laughs> but... Yeah, of course she does. Uh, I just have to design her bow, but of course she does. Still has her bow. Still has the same weapons. Just the outfit that she. Okay. Not pretty outfit. Then I have to fix the boots too. Yeah, I actually. I wanted to have her to have to like make her like I wanted her to have uh like laced up boots, but it's like that would have been a pain to draw in each panel. So I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna simplify her boots. But now I have the I have another problem because I'm like trying to figure out what I want them to look like. Which, you know, is... It's a problem. It's a problem. But... That's fine, that's fine. Okay, so...
Okay, I'm just packing something because making you know making sure that I'm still listening to Lo-Fi Girl because. I think I've been getting false copyright claims on my YouTube channel and possibly on my Twitch channel as well. Um, so, yeah, Lo Fi Girl is supposed to be, you know, how we use it for streams and stuff. So. Uh, it's kind of a no because I'm trying to have stuff I can listen to in the background while I'm streaming and that I'm not gonna get copyright claims but yeah I know it's and what's messed up too is that like I got copyright claim on stuff on thoughts that I haven't made public yet on YouTube because I still have to edit them because, like, one of them had, you know, remember, like, the time we played Kahoot? Like, we played Kahoot, Kahoot together on, like, on stream. And then there was, like, sad assholes that decided, hey, I'm gonna ruin everybody's day and be an ass. And I banned them stuff. I'm like, yeah, I want to edit that out because I don't want... Well, get rewash or VOD to deal with that. So, I might edit that out, but that I'm like. I also want to make like scenes probably with some of the streams I have. So. Alright, yeah, I kind of a note. Yeah, actually. What I'm going to do is I'm going to um mix mix in better. So, um I have to do the panels part. Uh Okay. Um. Okay, so that's like this sleep. And color. a bit wider. So 
looking at. It's gonna be a scarf there. Um... Okay, I know what I did. Okay, hang on. Realize what happened? I was wondering why this one on my arm looks so long compared to the other one. I realized what I did. Arms too fucking. Look, dear. was supposed to arrive there but I, I messed up so the arm ended up being a bit too short that should be fine that should be better yeah it happens the joys of anatomy huh can I redo that Uh, <laughs> I think this is just supposed to be the sketch. Oh no. <laughs> oh. So. I mean, to be fair, it doesn't have to be perfect. That's okay. It's okay if it's not perfect. It doesn't have to be perfect. To be, like, I'll be real with you. Like, the rule of, oh, it has to be anatomically correct and stuff is bullshit. So. Because, I mean, if, you know, it's good to learn anatomy and proportions. Uh, but it's like, you don't have to. Because the point of art is to, you know, be able to express yourself and stuff. It's like, exactly. Exactly, break the bone. Fuck anatomy. Like. There we go. Just have fun, experiment. I mean, yeah, you know, it's good to learn the rules. 
Oh, yeah. I mean, it's like... Besides, you can't really, like... Be too anatomically correct. Like... Because it's like... When you're drawing poses for a character, it's like, at the same time... There's such a thing as exaggeration that makes it more dy like makes your you know character look more dynamic and stuff. So sometimes anatomy and proportions might get in the way. So yeah, exactly. And it's like if you're just focusing on making your character like like you know uh anatomically correct and proportions correct it's like yeah your character's gonna look a bit stiff so it's learning to just exaggerate and stuff so like people saying oh, you have you have to do you absolutely have to do your line art in colors you can't you can't Oh, you'd have to is you'd have to send me a pic in the server. Uh, like, oh, you can't use black to do your line art. You absolutely have to use colors, and it's like, you know, sometimes I use colors for my, you know, I I color my line art, and sometimes I don't. Depends on how I feel. And either way, I'm like, yeah, it still looks the same. It just depends on your art style and what you want. Like saying, oh, you can't shade with black. Yes, you can. Depends on the style you're going for. Like, I don't know, shade with black can make more dramatic. No. But that and like also saying, oh, well, well, you know, like I'm trying to find my art style, but it's like, you know, the way you draw, like you draw your character is gonna evolve anyways, whether you want you want it or not, because you know, the more you draw, the better you get. Like ninety nine percent of the time, so like you, you know, you try out different ways to draw eyes, like for example. Like, I'm drawing Wisteria's eyes a different way than I usually do. But... You know, as I grow older and as I grow in a, as an artist, I realize... Yeah, the point of your style is more like how you do your strokes, how you color things, like that kind of fun stuff. And it's like, you can still experiment with your art style and it's going to change... Don't worry too much about it, I guess. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I got, I got what you mean for uh, by uh, the final senses of anatomy. Yeah, it looks pretty cool though. So, and I mean, there's still like some anatomy and proportion still. It's just because they probably focus on the pose itself or dynamic and stuff. So. That it's not it's a cartoon character. It's not real, so you can you can pose however you want. You can flex all you want. Aww. that's kind of sad. Kind of boring when you're going with deliverable poses. Like, yeah, make it more, like, you know, more dynamically. As much as I, you know, I more or less air about Sonic, uh, it's like, you know, that the 90s poses that 
you know, they gave to him in the 90s, but it's kind of iconic, so kind of sad they strayed away from that. <laughs> um, exactly. And now, and now they moved away from that. It's kind of boring. Kind of uh, boring from them. Okay, so Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Dang. If we don't talk about him, actually, it goes back to Sonic. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you, you, you do like Sonic. Quite a lot. <laughs> yeah. You are, you were passionate about Sonic. I mean, it's good to be passionate about stuff. Also, Cribble, if you ever start streaming, uh, do remember to turn off your uh, viewer account. This man is it does it feel so much better to stream without saying how many average viewers you have while you stream. So much better for the me for your mental health. Like, you know, when you're streaming. You should be focusing on what you're doing and, you know, the people you're talking to. Not on the numbers. You can focus on the numbers after the stream. So, well, yesterday I was watching the, um, wheelchair rugby game between the U.S. and Canada. Because right now it's the Paralympics in Tokyo. And, man, was it intense. I mean, I think we won the first round. Like, maybe, 
first quarter at least. Like he won 28 to 27 against the US. I, while I was watching that, I was like, man, I don't need to use a wheelchair. Thankfully, but still, I want to try that. That looks fun. And then I saw like just the players just flying around. I'm like, you know, maybe not. Uh, it looks a bit too intense. Well, it was fun to watch. Really fun to watch. So, uh, and I'm glad they're actually make they're having like a better coverage of the Paralympic Games this year. Yeah, yeah, extreme sports are in fact extreme, especially if like you're using a wheelchair. Of like, they're bulky. I mean, once they're using your specifically specifically made for like sports and stuff so they can go fast and probably easier to measure and stuff but it's like yeah or like one of the canadians was like passing the ball to one of his teammates and he didn't exactly like succeed in the pass but still looked pretty still it was still pretty cool. Um, like you can, you can watch the full coverage of the Paralympic Games on like the Paralympic, uh, like um, uh, official YouTube channel. Like I think yeah, they have all of them, and pretty cool. But yeah, it's like obviously they're gonna be using wheelchairs. Um, some of the game, like some of the s disciplines, like you, I think one of them is like. You sit down the ground and you're passing the ball and like throwing it, throwing it and stuff. And there's uh, one of those, the events that I'm actually really looking forward to is the uh, 100 meters P13 because uh, what like the son of one of my old teachers is actually taking part in it in the race. So, and I'm like looking forward to see the event. Yeah. Uh, yeah, actually, pretty much everybody in town, like, we're a small town, so I'm mostly tightly knit. So, basically, everybody knows everybody. Well, I don't because I'm mostly. No, but still. Uh, it's mostly, like, you know, tightly knit, so, like, there's a lot of, like, signs and, like, billboards saying, Hey, Aust like, uh, like, uh, like, cheering on for the, for the kid, for the kid. Uh, so. And, yeah, I mean, he's a bit younger than my brother, but still pretty impressive, especially since, like, he only started, like, like running and like athletics in like grade eight. So it's so pretty impressive that he managed to get that far. And yeah. Like it's pretty cool because like okay, so he's fine, but like you can still see like lines and stuff and shapes. It's just a light you can't really see, so I have no idea what his vision looks like, but he doesn't need a guide, so he can easily, like, run, he does, like, without much problem, and, man, I'm looking forward to see the race, it's gonna be fun. Uh, I think it's supposed to be... I don't remember when it, it's going to be, but... Still. Gonna be fun. Yeah. I mean, the Olympics are over, but yeah. Yeah, no, I heard. It was pretty cool. Like, it was pretty cool. The Philippines finally won the first ever Olympic gold. 
So, I bet your family was like really happy about about that. So, well, I bet just generally every Filipino was like very happy about that. <laughs> He is very poggers. And here's to more gold medals for the Philippines. Yeah, I mean, we have it all on like a few gold medals. I don't remember how many, but you know, I mean, one of few medals. Obviously, it's like. Our 40 is obviously not the summer games. It's the winter games. The winter Olympics. Usually. So. The winter Olympics! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we actually have the 2020 Olympic Games one. That's fine. The older ones are fun. Like it's been a while since the last time I played them because oh. I really need to settle to design for Wisteria once and for all. Or at least something I can keep for a while. So I can start working on the actual comic. So. I'll be right back. Oh, um, uh, you know, Legend of Zelda, just fantasy stuff in general. Uh, a bit of Fire Emblem, a bit of everything, really. Uh, so. Be right back. Talking about that in a sec.
right, I'm back. I was just getting some water. Uh, taking a bit of a break. Uh, yeah, I got, I got water, so. Thank you. Uh, I can't spell, but that's fine. Okay. Okay. And uh. Um... Uh, uh, thank you. Oh. 
Ah, that's where. Oh, what I wanted. To Give it a sec. I messed up a bit. good i'm just having some issues with like my uh my thing or like stuff i have to look directly at um uh, at the chat so i don't know I wasn't having just- I'm just having some issues with my chat. Uh. I get back. Oh, oh. What have I done? Uh. Oh god. Oh well. Okay. Anyways. Oh, 
I'll try to go finish. Ah, there you go. I was having issues with my chat box. That's back to normal. That's good. Okay. Um. So now, what did I want to? Um. Um, probably go with, uh, probably, okay. Uh, okay.
Yeah, I think that's gonna be it for digging. Because uh, I really have to think about what I'm going to do for the outfit, and I need to out. Uh, so, um, since I'm gonna be doing uh, guerrilla streams for a bit. Uh, I guess I'll let you know uh, next time I stream. But uh, thanks for coming. I uh, hope you enjoyed yourselves. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye!